What up you guys, it's Christina and I am so happy to be back with you today to share with you a natural remedy that will help you combat the flu and will also help you get rid of mucus. Flu season is upon us and many of you know that I am all about taking preventative measures to ensure that we are boosting our immunity and taking care of our health so that we can be our happiest selves. The recipe that I'm going to be sharing with you today is extremely strong and I've shared a version of this recipe for the past couple of years during flu season because I believe in it so much and because it works so well. I am not a doctor, therefore I cannot tell you not to go get a flu shot. However, I can share with you what I personally do during this time of year to ensure that my body gets that extra boost of nutrients that it might need. People are always asking me about the flu shot. So this is my contribution to help you get healthier and to also teach you a juice remedy that you will hopefully find to be very useful in your home. You will need a juicer to make this recipe and I highly recommend the Nama juicer. It's the one that I have in my kitchen. It's the one that I've been sharing with you for a while now because I love it so much. It is a slow, cold pressed, masticating juicer that I believe delivers the best quality of juice you can find. If you're looking for a new juicer or if you wanna check out the Nama, please click on the link in the description below or you can even use the code FLU10 for a special discount on this juicer. Definitely take advantage of this. This is a juicer that you need to have in your kitchen. I absolutely love it. With the holidays coming up, this is the perfect gift and it gives you an opportunity to get in the kitchen and learn how to start juicing so that you can be in the best shape of your life. After this year, I hope you can see how important it is to take care of yourself and that health is the greatest measure of wealth that you have. What you put in your body does matter. I will be making approximately one cup of this juice to share with you today, but you can make a larger batch if you want and you don't have to drink this whole cup at one time. You can sip on it throughout the day. Or if you're very serious about this remedy right now, or if you're really trying to boost your immunity, I recommend making a larger batch, maybe even 32 ounces of this, and drinking it throughout the week if possible. How long you wanna drink this juice is up to you. I'm simply recommending a cup a day to keep all that nasty phlegm away. This juice remedy isn't just a preventative measure that you can take to help you combat the flu, but also, like I said, it is great to help clear mucus out of your body. Man, does it wipe out your sinuses in a good way. It also helps you to reduce inflammation in the body. It aids in better digestion. I find that it helps me to sleep better. Uh, it helps to get rid of acne and to give you beautiful glowing skin. The benefits of this juice are endless. In addition with this juice recipe today, I always recommend that you practice proper self-care habits. Well, what does that mean exactly? It means eating a proper diet, eating good food, going vegan, eating raw vegan foods, getting enough sleep, getting in enough exercise, making sure you're spending time in nature, taking care of your mental health, keeping positive people around you, keeping a loving environment around you. All of these things together will definitely help to boost your immunity. When our immune system is strong, we have a better chance to protect ourselves from any invaders uh, or sicknesses that might come our way. Full disclosure, you will feel the fiery effect of this juice because it contains warming ingredients in it like garlic, ginger, and jalapeno. However, I do believe that it is a good sensation. You might not be able to drink it all in one sitting and that is okay. Pace yourself. Or if you're anything like me and you really love a good, intense, flavorful juice, you're gonna soak this one right up. Or maybe I should just say gobble this one right up, but I do just wanna mention, chew your juices. It's important, make sure you mix it with your saliva. 
If you love intense juices like me, then you are absolutely going to love this one. The antibacterial and antifungal properties of this juice are unparalleled. And that is exactly why it is so good to have a good quality juicer in your home to make sure that you are receiving all of the benefits from this juice. I'm a huge fan of using slow, cold pressed, masticating juicers to make remedies like this, to make uh, tinctures like this or shots like this because they help to maintain the quality of the juice. Not only is a slow cold press juicer going to save you in the money long term because it will help you get the most yield out of your produce, but also there will be less oxidation, less heat in the process of making this juice and just the quality, the taste, you can taste the difference. It holds more of the nutrients in the juice and it doesn't change colors as fast. That's really important when looking for a good juicer and that's exactly why I'm always recommending the Nama to everyone because I've seen the least amount of oxidation and the highest yield with this juicer. So over a period of time, this juicer is gonna save you money in the long term and it will deliver you the best quality of juice. Some of you might've seen on my channel that I've done several juicer comparison videos. Uh, comparing pineapple, celery, carrots, and also testing things like the yield, the oxidation, uh, the pulp, everything. And the Nama has won every single time. I'm blown away at how awesome this juicer is. I think there should be one in every single household. I really can't recommend it enough. Please check out the links in the description below. Use the code FLU10 and if you don't already have one in your home, get this juicer so that you can make this remedy all the time. A lot of people have been asking me to do another comparison, comparing which juicer is the easiest to clean. And I'm really excited to say that I think that might be my next video coming up. That one was fun. You guys are gonna like this one. <laughs> so let's talk about each of these ingredients first before I run them through the juicer because I really do believe that education when it comes to juicing is so important. Oftentimes I find that the more you educate yourself about something, the more motivated you are to do it because the benefits are endless. So let's get you motivated. My hair is so big today. I feel like my head is almost about to just kind of fall off because my hair is so heavy. Speaking of hair, first ingredient is garlic. Uh, my mother always told me when I was little that garlic would make my hair grow faster. Maybe it's true, I have a lot of hair, and I'm also Lebanese, so uh, there you go. <laughs> the first ingredient that we're gonna be running through our juicer is garlic, and garlic is one of the most powerful antifungal, antibacterial ingredients that you can consume. If you've been following my Instagram stories for the past month, then you will know that I was bitten by a brown recluse spider. I don't know if I'll be making a video about that. <laughs> Not sure if I wanna share another spider bite video, but I was bitten by a brown recluse this past month. Yes, I'm recovering and healing, but one of the first things that I did was put crushed garlic on the wound, on the bite, and it immediately drew out the venom and began to pull out the infection. Garlic is powerful and we're going to be adding in approximately two to three large cloves of garlic into this juice. The next ingredient that we're going to be adding is ginger. And ginger is not only good for digestion, but it is also a key ingredient that helps to clear mucus out of your intestinal tract. It's a very powerful root vegetable that will add a spice or flair to any creation that you're making. And I personally love the warmth and the scent of adding ginger to juice. I'm probably gonna add in about two, maybe three large thumbs of ginger into this juice, but if you want it to be more fiery, you can always add in maybe one or two more thumbs at the most. Next up, we're talking about turmeric. Turmeric is an inflammation fighting machine. And you can see by this bright, beautiful orange color just how full of life it is. Turmeric has curcumin in it, which is one of the key active compounds in it that not only helps to fight inflammation, but also helps to aid in reducing your risk of having heart disease, reducing your risk of Alzheimer's, and so much more. I will be adding two very large thumbs of turmeric into this juice. The next ingredient for this remedy is apple cider vinegar, and we're gonna be adding 
approximately two heaping tablespoons of apple cider vinegar into the juicer. And because it's already a juice, it's already like fermented, we're just gonna pour it into the juicer. Apple cider vinegar is an amazing ingredient to help break down mucus and to help clear your sinuses. Raw apple cider vinegar is also a very healthy probiotic for your gut and can help aid in elimination. One teaspoon of a fresh jalapeno. Now yes, that's the next ingredient that we'll be adding. Now you can either cut off the tip of a jalapeno or even if you have a chili pepper, you can just cut off the tip, deseed it, and add that into your juicer. Juicing jalapeno will help to clear any mucus that you have in your upper respiratory system. It will actually help you to breathe better. If you've never juiced jalapeno before, then you're in for a nice surprise because it's not as spicy as you might think. We're only starting off with a small thumb or like I said, a teaspoon of the fresh jalapeno at the end here because I do want this juice to be palatable for you. If you're scared about it being too spicy, be sure you've removed the seeds. If you're feeling a bit more daring, then leave the seeds in. I actually love jalapenos with a really good celery, beet, cilantro, carrot, lime juice. Oh my gosh, it's just, it's delicious. We're also gonna be adding in two peeled and sliced lemons or limes. The benefits of juicing lemons or limes is through the roof. They're super high in vitamin C, they make your juice so much more tasty, and they basically provide all the rest of the benefits that I've mentioned with the other ingredients here as well. There are two ingredients that I normally would add into this juice that I don't have today but I actually feel that it's appropriate that I don't have them because now this juice is gonna be even more intense and perfect for this season, I believe. But those two ingredients that I normally would add would be radish, a daikon radish or a horseradish, and also some pineapple to sweeten it up. Now, if you're like me and if you like your juices really intense, then you can just do the juice just like this. You don't need to add anything sweet, but if you feel like this is gonna to be too intense for you, then I recommend adding just a little bit of pineapple or apple to your juice, and that's okay. If you have access to daikon radish or horseradish or just a regular pink radish, you know the ones you find at the store, you can add those into this juice as well, and I'd maybe add maybe about a tablespoon of it. I personally love spicy and intense juices, but if the thought of that scares you, by all means, please add in extra pineapple or apple. I've been juicing for years. I juice pretty much every single day, so my body has acclimated to drinking more nutrient-rich juices. And eventually, over time, you crave them. Your body just wants them. Don't get me started on green juice. I have a green juice addiction. I pretty much drink green juice every single day for breakfast or as my first meal of the day. For those of you who would like to access the exact ingredients for this juice recipe, please download my Fully Raw Recipe app. Yes, I have a mobile app. It's available on iTunes and Google Play, which means all iPhone and Android users have access to it. There are more than 400 recipes in my app. It is the number one place to access raw vegan recipes. I'll go ahead and put my links below so that you can give it a download and thank you. All right, so let's make this juice, shall we? Let's get started. The first ingredient that we're gonna run through our juicer is garlic. So go ahead and run your three cloves of garlic through your juicer first. After this, you can add in your two thumbs of ginger here. If you feel like adding in a third thumb of ginger, you can do that, but I'm just letting you know it will be a little bit more fiery for you. After this, add in two large thumbs of turmeric. I always recommend buying organic whenever possible, especially for these root veggies. After the turmeric, we're gonna add in a teaspoon or the end of the jalapeno. If you want it to be less spicy, then absolutely remove the seeds. Next, we'll add our peeled and sliced lemons or limes. And last but not least, we'll run through our juicer, our apple cider vinegar. These ingredients should give you approximately one cup of juice. If it falls short, you can always add in a little bit of apple or pineapple, or you can always add in some extra turmeric. Once all of your ingredients have been run through your juicer, you can strain this or you can drink it just as is. 
Pour this remedy into your cup of choice. I'm choosing a mason jar that I can easily seal tight later if I can't drink the whole thing. And voila, look at this ladies and gentlemen. You have a flu or cold and mucus fighting remedy right here that you've made from home. All right, you guys, are you ready for the final taste? <laughs> Let's give it a try. Oh yeah, that's good. Oh yeah, that's good. <laughs> Ooh. Oh my gosh, wow. Mm. Already my mouth is just watering and I can feel the warmth or the, like, the heating sensation kind of going down my digestive tract, my esophagus, I can feel that going down right now. Mm. Mmm, yes, oh, that is perfect. Mmm, see, I didn't add any pineapple or apple to this, and I think it's perfect. My eyes are starting to water a little bit, and I feel my sinuses starting to clear. <laughs> I also feel myself starting to sweat a little bit, and that's exactly what this is supposed to do. Mmm, this is delicious. Mmm, yes, oh, mmm. I feel the energy from this already. This is my jam. This is my jam. My eyes are, my eyes are watering a little bit, but in a good way. <laughs> if you guys have liked this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button because there's only more goodness to come. And I have a new juicer comparison video coming up very, very soon. Also, if you're interested in getting a Nama juicer, Take advantage of the special discount by using the code FLU10 at checkout. I'll put a link in the description below for you as well so that you can check out all the information on my favorite juicer. And if you're interested in downloading my Fully Raw app and getting recipes like this and 400 more, you can download my app on iTunes or Google Play and those links are below for you as well. Thank you all so much for joining me in this video today. I hope that you have found it to be helpful and educational. That is essentially my goal, is getting people to live their healthiest lives. And thank you for being on this journey with me. Again, thank you so much for joining me today. I cannot wait to see you all in my next video. Sending you all my hugs and my love. Spicy, it makes you want to dance. I got like whew, my salsa going on. Oh, ah, oh, ah. Mm. This one will make you sweat. Just wanting you to know, you might want to put on some like spicy salsa music while you're making this one. And that way, you just have like that that Latina flair going on, you know? Oh yeah. Oh, I feel this one feels so good. I definitely would have added more jalapeno though. This one just charged me up. I'm so charged up even just after that sip and I'm gonna finish this tonight. Oh yeah.